Hi, my name's Kate Philbin and I'm an MA illustration student with Falmouth Flexible. I've been sent this lovely bag by Casa and I'm just going to show you now what's inside. This is part of the student day promotion for this year. So we have this lovely tote bag and it says cobalt blue on the front, which is fab. Um, and then inside, ooh, we've got Baby Castell Pit Graphite Matte. Um, this looks like a really nice pencil. I really like these Faber Castell drawing pencils, so I'm looking forward to using that. Um, next, we've got up oh, Ink Tense Derwent Ink Tense pencils. Um, I already use these because I used to do quite a lot of work with textiles, but um, these look like they're new colours, so yeah, I'm really looking forward to using those. Um, let's see what else we've got. Oh, a little book, an artist's A6 uh, sketch pad by De La Roney, really handy little size book. And um, ooh, Pentel Art Brush Sign Pen here, and also Pentel Oil Pastels. So that's really cool, two in one. Um, we've got Ecoline Duo Tip pen never used that before i don't actually think i've used anything by eco line brand and some masking tape oh i've been searching everywhere for some masking tape that doesn't rip up my paper so i have high hopes for that um i've got a handful of things here um tombow marker i have used these before um it's got these double-sided so that's really cool as to be low um highlighter always need a highlighter I'm not sure what this is, Faber-Castell. I do use Faber-Castell pencils, um, but maybe this is a different shape because it's triangular shape, so I'd be interested to use that. A Stabilo fine liner, and uh, this looks like, yeah, Uni Pin fine liner as well. I think I've used those before. Oh, Liquitex. Oh, this is very exciting. Liquitex acrylic ink. I've never used that before, but I have used the acrylics, and here's... Uh, a heavy body acrylic, a Liquitex heavy body. I really like that acrylic paint. And I think this, I think I just saw another one of these. Yeah, there it is. There's two of these acrylic pens. So that's very cool. And uh, last but not least, we've got a nice uh, sketch pad here. So I'm really looking forward to making something with these. And I'll see you in the next video where I'll do that. Bye for now.